Today we have a special guest who will host the George Show, Ninja Joe 10. He will teach you how to grow instead of me. So please give a warm welcome to Ninja Joe. Roll it! Hello Ray, this is, this is Ninja 10, but you can just call me Joe. From what I understand, I'm on the Freedom Channel. Yes, you are Ninja. I will let him teach you, but first I will introduce Joe so you know who he is. Ninja Joe, recently re Ninja Joe recently left a comment as a joke saying, would it be cool if he could host an episode of The George Show? I replied saying, why not? Send me a video. And he also introduced himself or reintroduced himself on the Freedom Forums. The link is down there in the description below. He is 17 years old. He is from Latvia and he enjoys playing video games and his biggest dream is to actually do YouTube full-time. How many of you have the same dream? Well, that's what freedom is here for, to help you reach that dream and grow together as a family. So without further ado, I will let Ninja Joe take over the George Show and present what I hope you will find a helpful tip about thumbnails. Roll it! Today, I guess I'm like a guest or something like that, and I'll be talking about how I make my uh, channel thumbnails. And after that, I'll also talk about my journey on YouTube. And hey, maybe I'll even uh, give you hope on maybe starting a channel, maybe continuing your channel. I don't know. We'll, we'll just see. Okay, so first, first of all, how I how I make my uh, thumbnails. I don't I don't use Photoshop or anything like that. I use a free uh, website, Pixelr. How I make my thumbnails? Let, let's see. So first of all, uh, I, I forgot what I clicked. Okay, so yeah, create a new image and let's go to 720p, transparent because I like it. I like that. Okay, so first of all, we need a good background. So what I like to do is go to my videos and uh, I don't know, just find a good uh, find, find like a, something that would be a good background. Don't mind this layout. Uh, it would the best would be if it's something like really bright or something like that. Okay, yeah, I do use Premiere Pro for my editing, and from what I understand, someone else is gonna be editing this. So yeah, that's really interesting. Yeah, I I do it. I do like a real weird version where I basically. Uh, well, yeah, I I basically just delete. I basically get one frame, J just get one frame, okay, so yeah, I get, let's just get rid of the layout, and let's have that, because the with the layout it might look a bit weird, I guess, I don't, I don't, that, does, that, that doesn't really matter for, for my kind of way, so what I do is I export it, oh, Premiere Pro, no, oh no, deck, De Hey, come on. I said export. Okay, there you go. So, I don't know, just... This is some stuff. H... Hold up, so the format is H.264 and and this doesn't really matter. Just go for YouTube 1080p, I guess. And with the output, I have a special kind of... I guess kind of folder, like in other... And what I like to do, just for fun, is... I just like to go crazy. I don't know why. Anyways, the export that. That's not gonna take a long time. And I use a special kind of uh, thing with a, basically a video to JPEG converter. That's why uh, it's best to just keep it at one frame. Again, it's going to the special folder and it, it makes a new folder. And looking at how many frames you have. Uh, it's gonna show how many images, and since I only had one frame, it's only gonna be one image. So yeah, Control A and Control C to select all and copy. Then I'm gonna make this a bit smaller so more of the stuff gets in. I'm gonna box blur, which basically blurs the background, and also I'm gonna put the saturation up. Okay, so anyways, yeah, we we got the background. Now in the foreground, so. It depends on the series, like this is my Pixelmon Luscious Topaz series, so what I like to do, do is... Uh, 
basically get the logo in. So this is like a special kind of map with a special kind of logo. So yeah, I'll just have that in. Okay. Oh, also, I, I should, probably should have checked what the episode is. Oh yeah, now I remember. Okay, so this episode right here is about defeating uh, a special kind of dude, Maxi. So, I mean, obviously, uh, y you can do wh whatever you want, as long as it's in the YouTube community guidelines. Uh, yeah, also, but try not to go for, like, clickbait stuff. I guess maybe a little bit clickbait is okay, but not, like, full-on clickbait. Okay, anyways, what else? Oh, yeah, I do have, like, a channel logo, so, yeah, we I can use that as well. Okay. And you know what? Okay, so I defeat Maxi. Uh, Pokemon, yeah. Okay, so yeah, I I defeat uh, this dude. I don't know. Okay, yeah. The the best images are usually uh, PNG because then the background. Uh, you don't have to worry about the background. So say image as. I'm just gonna say it as. Uh, Ma <laughs> Maxia, apparently. Okay, oops, typo, but alright. Typos are okay, if you remember uh, what you typed, I guess. Yeah, okay, so yeah, boom, Maxi, let's go. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna flip it. Transform. He's gonna transform his body, I guess. Oh yeah, let, let's just make him dominant. Like, ooh! Alpha! Ooh, let's make Maxi a big ch chat. <laughs> yeah, you can you can get pretty meme with all this stuff. Okay, so eyes. Uh let's see. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I have a pretty good idea of what I'm gonna do. Obviously you don't wanna go too small because then you might the people might not even see it, so what I'll do here. Flip. Uh okay. No, never mind. Actually, what I'll do is I'll make the eyes be a bit close to each other. That might help. And now, give Max some eyes. I mean, he already has eyes, but like, wow. Okay, and also, uh, if I remember correctly, I had a brow. Yep. It's good to have like, uh, basically, I don't know. It's good to like have full on folders on. Upon folders. Okay, so yeah, I'm just gonna give a bro there. And, uh, also, make this bro a bit closer. Also, this isn't the best program. Ah, yeah. <laughs> okay, I, I guess Max is gonna have a unibrow. That, that's okay. You know, accidents can happen, and hey, hey you can work with the accidents. Okay, and now I gotta make myself look real scared. Uh, okay, so yeah, obviously the same eyes, because why not? Again, uh, you can just keep on experimenting with all this. I tell you, I guess... Like, I've been making thumbnails for my videos for over, like, what? Four years? Almost four years now. So yeah, it's been pretty crazy. Uh, okay, do I have a sweat? Yeah, I do. Although, I, I, I guess I can maybe use that. Yeah. I mean, if you don't have something, then you can usually get it from Google. Although, be careful about the copyright stuff. I don't know. Uh, okay, so. I do have a special kind of way of doing stuff with the Lustrous Topaz. So, I'm just gonna go quickly to my YouTube studio to see. Okay, yep. Yeah. And this is episode six. I don't even need a space. No? Need a space. Okay, so yeah, a font that I really like is Comic Sans because Undertale and Sans. <laughs> I don't know. Again, pretty meme, you know, pretty funny meme, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so yeah, uh, to edit, I guess to like edit the text size more, we just. Ra rasterize the layer? I don't even know what that word means, so just use it, I guess. Ooh, although, okay. I mean, it's best if the thumbnail doesn't really have much text. I 
I'm just going with what I've been do doing for some time. There's definitely better versions of doing this. I'm just going doing it my way. My way. Okay, uh, I guess, yeah, I can go a bit there. Maybe even add a little bit of bevel. Though not too much. Uh, okay, yeah, like a, like a pretty cool effect. Actually, hold up, let's go back to Maxi's eyes, yep. And, uh, again, just experiments, like, what, what, what's pretty, what could be pretty cool? Uh, <laughs> yeah, there, there could definitely be pretty crazy effects. Oh yeah, red eyes, like, full-on red eyes. Maybe a bit darker, maybe a bit saturated, again. The thumbnails are mostly just experimenting until you find something that works. I mean, you could spend hours and hours on this. I'm just going with a special kind of rhythm that I made in my mind, I guess. Uh, actually, let's go. Okay, uh, oh yeah. Although with this, it is it is kind of hard with the layers. Uh, hold up, not. Okay, uh, I wanted to copy that. And now I can add even more sweat. I mean, it's okay. Uh, I, I don't know if it's okay. If the sweat is, yeah, like over here, you can kind of see how uh, when this image is small, how well you can see it. Uh, it's not that easily, uh, it's not that easy to see it, but I don't know. I just like to add some little touches here and there, and a special kind of, yeah, I do have a special kind of folder for that. And again, you can name these files whatever you want, just be careful and be. Sh and be, be careful about it if you remember them. And yeah, you can also, you know, obviously add the thumbnail. I'm just gonna do it right now so it wouldn't later. Okay, so. Uh, and now the camera is. And now it's only the camera. <laughs> no, turn it there. Now it's only the camera. Boom. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know how, how this is gonna work. Okay, so yeah, uh, now it's, I guess, time for me just, just to talk about my experience with YouTube. So. Uh, I'll be, I will be using a little bit of YouTube Studio uh, just to uh, I don't know, check, but you, the, the viewers don't need to see that or whatever. Okay, so yeah, I started making videos on the twenty on 2014, 5th of December. Although my first ever video, first of all, was in Latvia, and second of all, I actually made the video in like the summer, but I only uploaded it in December because I don't know, it's late. I, I have been pretty lazy here and there, but like, yeah, after the first video, just, uh, first four videos were just daily, and after that, a, a bit of a, I don't know, break or something like that, I did have a little bit of school, but then, uh, winter break started, so, boom, yeah, I, I was able to upload more videos, but then school started again, and I kind of went a bit monthly, like one or two videos monthly, I experimented with some stuff, gaming, animation, a lot of gaming, okay, and 2016, okay, I can actually pinpoint the exact date. 1st of August 2016 was when I first started to make thumbnails, they were not good, they were terrible, but, but hey, it was something. Like, I almost, I did almost two years of YouTube without making any thumbnails, because back then, I started YouTube when I was 11, uh, I don't even know if... I was allowed to do that. I guess maybe with my parents' permission or something like that. Look, YouTube back then was a bit different. Maybe a bit edgy and that, that kind of stuff, I don't know. Okay, now 2017 is when my channel kind of started blowing up a bit more. I got 100 subs. I started collaborating with some people and actually... Uh... Uh... The, two of, of the people I started collaborating with, I did find through Freedom. And that definitely, that definitely helped me, especially in like 2017, June. Uh, yeah. Uh, I won't name them because, I don't know, their channels are kind of like dead or something like that. And I don't actually know if they stopped making YouTube videos. That is also a possibility that the people you work with might soon, at, some, at one point, stop making YouTube videos. But also the main point is just not giving up. Like. Yeah, I've been under 200 subs for like four years, and I I, I didn't give up. I uploaded. There were day there were times when I uploaded daily. There were times when I uploaded weekly. There were times when I missed some weeks, 
there was even one time and I missed a month, like a whole month, I forgot to upload because I was lazy and school and other stuff. But but yeah, I still didn't give up on YouTube. I, I basically uh, went through the laziness. I don't know, I, I battled the laziness, I guess. And yeah, 2018, I started a new series called Road to 100 where I tried to make 100 episodes in the same world. And boom, that went pretty well. Yeah, the first episode right now has over 250 views. So yeah, th that that went a bit higher. Uh, and that was like the first series uh, where I actually made a lot of episodes. Like before that, my most uh, episodic series or something like that, where I had the most episodes was Troll Vanilla, where I tried to, I guess, troll other people in Minecraft. That only had 13 episodes, so yeah. That was back in 2017. Uh, but yeah, I, I started some Pokemon because I, re I really like Pokemon. <laughs> I mean, that didn't do as good as Minecraft, but still, uh, that still did pretty good. I even started my own subreddit, which is right now dead, but I still experimented. Like, yeah, I did like a tier list when that was popular, I guess. More Pokemon. I, I started a series called So Bad's Good, where I tried really bad games that were actually so bad they were good. Like, funny good, yeah, 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 memes. Yeah, uh, uh, like, e last year, 2019, 5th of December, that was my, the five year mark when I did, uh, basically when I, again, I started YouTube in 2014, 5th of December. So I, I did my first video again, like a redo. So yeah, that was fun. That was fun, I guess. And now 2020, even bigger now. I'm not, I don't actually remember if it was 2019 or 2020, I think it was 2019 when I got over 200 subs. Yeah, uh, I, I started a couple more series here and there. I also tried like challenges, like the roomy, uh, some roomy challenges, that got somewhere, although yeah, obviously my singing is not good. Again, more, now Pixelmon, instead of Pokemon, it's Pixelmon. Uh, joining my two favorite things, Minecraft and Pokemon, joining them together, but Pixelmon, Lustrous Topaz, and then Pokemon G I actually got sponsored! And actually got paid! For like, making seven videos on a Pixelmon server. No joke, I actually got paid. <laughs> yeah, and that's basically uh, where I am right now. Yeah, if you like Minecraft, if you like Pixelmon, maybe like What the Golf, uh, I might do a bit of that, or maybe something else. You you can tell me in the comments, in, in my comments though. I don't I I'm not gonna read a lot of the freedom comments because it's not, not my channel, you know. I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know. Uh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, the main thing to take from this is just not to give up. Okay. Let, let me just. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Let, let me just quickly open Social Blade. Uh. Actually, I think with details, stats, it's easy to see. So yeah. Uh, it goes as far back as 2017. I know that earlier it went even further back, not anymore. So yeah, like back in 2017, boom, I had like a bit over 100 subs and my views less than 5k, less than 10k total. But but then uh, July 2019, boom, around 200 subs. And then my channel started growing and growing and now I'm here, over 230 subs and over 30k total views I, I basically like I added 10 more thousand 10 thousand more views to my total view count in just like less than six months less than six months oh jeez I cannot talk <laughs> oh okay yeah again don't don't give up experiments experiment experimenting is good obviously also find your niche like what, what you like to do, but what what also people like to watch. That that's a, like a really good combination. Like you do something that you like, but also people like to watch that stuff. I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know how to end this. I, I guess I'll just use my normal outro that I always do on my videos. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe, I and mean, subscribe. Press the notification bell to know when a new video comes out and on my channel I guess maybe comment what I should do, comment for more ideas I, I but yeah always at the end I ask for the viewers to comment for more ideas and I do sometimes get ideas I just I, I and I do write them down I just a lot of times forget 
yeah, I, I should definitely <laughs> get on that. Yeah, biggest challenge for me is battling laziness, school, and other stuff. Like, the only time when I record videos is when my parents aren't home, because then I feel the most comfortable, com comfortable actually recording videos. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, anyways, bye! Ooh, you dreaming about love. Yeah. Click that eye to partner with Freedom and join the Freedom family so we can all grow together. You get many perks like position music, you also get epidemic sound, a lot of other access to royalty free videos, sponsorships, and many things to help you grow. Just click the links down there in the description below to get involved in our community, our forums, our Discord chat servers, meet our graphics team, meet our community team, all of that on Discord and the forums. What are you waiting for? Get started. And we will grow together as a family because this is the Freedom Family. You are part of it, we are all part of it, and we're all growing together. To get more George, click that big F. That will subscribe you to Freedom Central, home of The George Show. And PewDiePie gave one of you, Freedom Family, a big shout out. Click that video to see the shout out and to see our new 3D sets for you. And click that video to see what YouTube recommends you watch next.